What's going on, YouTube? So, I was not planning on, you know, doing a video like this. But apparently, a certain somebody wants to run his little punk mouth about me. Whose niece I'm very good friends with. And to this dude's niece, I'd like to say this. I'm sorry that you have to go through what you're going through with your uncle. I'm seriously sorry that you have to go through what you do with your freaking asshole of an uncle. But to the douchebag Frank Jameson that thinks he's going to get me. No, you're not. You ain't going to do jack shit, bro. Because like I told you in our little conversation on Facebook, I'm not afraid of you, bro. I am not afraid of you at all whatsoever. I've had worse motherfuckers than you threaten my fucking life. And yet, here I am, motherfucker. Still right here, bro. Yeah, you may have served in Vietnam. So what? My Uncle Dale served in Nam. Okay? And so what? You're ex-CIA. No one gives a fuck. Alright? And if you think that I'm fucking scared of you, I'm not. I'm really not afraid of you, bro. I've had worse motherfuckers than you roll up to my fucking house on a Sunday wanting to beat my ass. So, go ahead and bring your little bitch ass up here. Because like I said, I'm not afraid of you, Frankie. I'm not afraid of your fucking Frankenstein looking ass, bro. Because like I told you, dog. Smaller target. Harder to hit, motherfucker. I'm a smaller target. I'm harder to hit, plus I'm quicker. Alright? You're fucking with an army brat, dude. You're fucking with somebody that's an army brat, bro. I'm not afraid of you. And if you don't think I won't beat your ass, well then, why well, don't show your old wrinkly ass up here and fucking find out just how serious I am. Like I told you, I'm not afraid of you. I'm not afraid of any of your little fucking friends, bro. Because like I told you, dog, I faced death as a fucking child and survived. And yet... I'm still here, bitch. I'm still here. What are you going to do? Nothing. And like your niece said, bro, you need to get help. Like your niece told you, bro, you need fucking help. For real. You need to shut your fucking old ass up and get fucking help, bro. For real. Shut your old wrinkly ass up and get fucking help, dude. Why don't you shut your goddamn mouth and get some goddamn help? Because clearly you fucking need it, bro. Clearly you need it. Like I told you, man, I'm a fucking music artist, okay? I'm not with the CIA. I'm not with whoever you think I am, bro. I'm a fucking musician, okay? And I can prove that time and time again. Like I told you, bro, I don't want to fight you. But if it's a fight you're looking for with me, I can guarantee you 100% you're going to fucking lose, old man. If it's a fight you want, then fucking bring it. Like I told you, I like a good challenge. I love a good challenge. So if it's a fight you want, then fucking bring it, old man. Otherwise, sit your old wrinkly bitch ass down and get some fucking help. Because clearly, you fucking need it. Clearly, you fucking need help. You need to sit your old ass down, go to the doctor, get some fucking meds, and get some help. Because like I told your niece, I'm not afraid of you, bro. I've had motherfuckers like Marty roll up six fucking deep. I've had cops show up with ten pistols pointed at my fucking dome. At one fucking time. So you really think I'm afraid of you? No, I'm not. 
So, Frank Jameson, why don't you shit your pussy ass down, get some help, and shut the fuck up? Because clearly, you're in over your fucking head on this one, bro. I'm the one guy you don't want to fuck with. I don't care who you may go missing in the past or whatever. Bro, in my eyes, you're just like every other fucking idiotic troll out there. Okay? You're just like every other fucking idiot troll out there. You're all bark and no fucking bite, bitch. You're all fucking bark and no bite. Alright? I've had fucking ten pistols pointed at my dome at one time. So do you really think I fear you? No, I don't. You could have a fucking knife to my neck, a gun to my head, I don't give a fuck. Chances are I'll grab that pistol and I'll beat your fucking ass with it. So like I said, Frankie, I'm not the one to fuck with. I am not the one to fuck with, bro. Like I said, I may be five foot three, but trust me, this five foot three motherfucker can kick your goddamn ass. And if you're so desperate to find out, why don't you bring your ass up here and find out? If you're so desperate to find out, why don't you bring your punk ass up here and I'll show you what an ass beating looks like. Because like your niece told me, bro, you need fucking help. You clearly need fucking help. So honestly, Frankie, you need to sit your fucking old ass down and you need to get fucking help. Because like I told your niece, bro, Unlike her exes, I'm not going nowhere, bro. Honestly, I like your niece. Your niece is cool as shit. But like I said, unlike her exes, I don't scare off so easily. Alright? I'm not afraid of you, dog. I'm really not. And if you think I am... Like I said, bring your old ass up here and find out just how scared of you I'm not. Because like I said, the moment that you show up on my doorstep, it's your funeral, not mine. You show up on my doorstep, I can promise you, bro, your ass will be leaving in fucking handcuffs in the back of a cop car quick and easy to say, fuck my life. So Frankie... Shut your old bitch ass up, take some fucking meds, and calm your hyper ass down. Because like I told you in our conversation, bro, I ain't out to pick a fight with you. I'm not out to pick a fucking fight with your ass, bro. If anything, I'm trying to be chill with your niece because your niece is cool as fuck. If anything, your niece is a made person. Your niece is doing well for herself. I mean, come on. Your niece is traveling the world. She does business for a fucking living, bro. She travels the globe every day making big fucking boss moves. Your niece travels the world making boss ass moves. And I respect that shit. I respect the hustle. I respect the grind that she's got going. I respect the ever-living fuck out of that shit. I respect that shit, dog. So, like I said, James, or should I say Frankie, or should I say Frankie Munez? Actually, no, no, that's too good for you. Shout out to the actor, Frankie Munoz, though, man. Good actor. But Frankie, Frankenstein, listen. Like I told you, 
I'm not afraid of you, dog. I'm really not afraid of you. All right? So if you think that I'm going to run so easily, bring it. Yeah, Shia, what's up? Like I said, Frankie, I'm not out to fight nobody, bro. But when you push it to the point to where you're doing... You're just asking to get your ass kicked and to get called out. As I said, I'm not out to fucking fight you. I'm not out to attack you. I'm not out to beat your ass. But honestly, you need to shut your mouth. You need to quit attacking motherfuckers, all right? Ain't nobody done anything to you, bro. I haven't done anything to you. I ain't done nothing to you. Oh, and by the way, Frankie, a little advice for you, bro. Don't listen to music, bitch boy Marty, because that dumb fuck's full of shit anyway. And I have the proof to back it up. So trust me, I say... Just some advice, man to man. Don't trust Marty. All right? Because Marty's a fucking sick little bitch. Who, honestly, is off his rocker. So you can send your supposed biker friends. Or you can come down here yourself. But either way, it ain't going to end well for you, bro. I don't want to see you dead. I don't want to see you end up in jail. I don't want to have to kick your fucking ass. I don't want to have to do that, bro. I don't want to have to be the guy that beat your fucking ass. Because I'm that guy that ain't going to run. I'm that guy that if you come at me sideways, bro, I'm that guy that if you try to do harm to me or my family, well, fucking what? You're getting your fucking ass beat. I'm that guy that's not afraid. I'm that guy that will defend his family. I'm that guy that will do what I have to do in order to protect my family. I'm that guy that's not afraid of death. I'm that guy that welcomes death like an old friend. So if you think I'm fucking scared of you, Frankie, I'm not, bro. So my advice to you, Frank, my advice to you, Frank, sit your ass down, shut the fuck up, and get some fucking help. Because clearly you fucking need it. All right? Now, if you excuse me, I have a fucking job to get back to do. Plus... I was having fun hanging out with your niece and talking with her. All right? I was actually having a good time hanging out with your niece, showing her some of my photography work, hanging out with her doing all sorts of shit like that, showing her my artwork and shit. So I'm going to go back to having fun and having a normal life. So, Frankie, fuck you and fuck your bullshit. Because as I said, I'm not afraid of you. Bitch. Oh, and one last word for you, Frankie. Don't fucking try me. It ain't gonna work. So like I said, my last bit of advice for you, bro. Sit down. Shut up. And get some fucking help. Because you need it.